Hey, what's up you guys? It's another vlog and today I'm doing some more Grubhub. Oh yeah, it's a hot day. Um, it's, you know, one of those unusual Colorado, it's still not spring actually technically, it's winter, it's the end of winter. It's, uh, <laughs> if you're from Colorado, you should know, it's probably gonna snow in the next like few days just because we've had too many hot days in a row. So here I am doing some more grub hubbies. I'm waiting for an order. I'm working all the way until 1 p.m. and then I get an hour and a half break because I made it like that way for myself on purpose. Um, I haven't gotten much. Uh, I've only gotten pretty much the $10 an hour minimum guarantee. Um, I think I have $18.98 for these first two hours and it's like, girl. I think I'm a dollar or two under the minimum. So they're probably just gonna compensate me for that. Unless um, for my next two hours I make like an amazing amount, which we'll see. Mornings and afternoons are usually slow. Fuck boy. Oh, he's checking his car. Like I kind of expect. Yeah? Making sure it's beautiful? I don't give a shit enough. Because this car is mainly for work. Kind of like work shoes. Okay, I'm back. But like that was weird just because I have like all these neighbors out and I don't want to be seen. Yeah, like there's so much activity. I'm probably gonna vlog a lot less today um, while I'm out and about for Grubhub just because it's like I'm so busy. I'm back to back to back. I can't really stop and vlog. Um, there's too many people out and about. But yeah, I gotta give you an apartment tour because I didn't do that since I moved in. I just, so much has been going on during this first year here. I think I might be doing a second year here just because of my situation. I might need more time <laughs> before I can move on to a house. Okay, so I decided I haven't gotten an order in a while, so I have some time to like go around and show you things. So let's do that. My main entryway. Um, as you can see, it's double as fuck, so no bitch can break in. <laughs> we have this closet, which since we moved in has had this problem here. It's had this problem of not being able to open properly, because this part right here is actually supposed to be in. It's supposed to just go along the track, but if you pull too hard, it just like comes off. <sighs> and then, gay. Okay. Um, we have all of our crap here. That's our shitty little vacuum. Katie's room. There's mine and my husband's room. And then we have the kitchen here. Um, don't ask how we got a whole entire display from fucking. Target. <laughs> That's crazy. Um, we've got our laundry bin as a household because, of course, when do we not have a lot of laundry? That we don't have both working. We actually only have one working. The story of that one is that we put a plate in there that had some kind of like paint that was made out of metal, and it zapped the uh, paint off the plate. And we were like, oh, we didn't think of anything of it. It just burned off the paint off the plate. But instead, it actually fried the whole entire thing. So, lesson learned. Being an adult is sometimes scary and hard because then you do it by yourself and you're like, what the fuck? Then we have our beautiful kitchen, which is tiny. There's all of Katie's pictures. Um, here's our little fridge. Our whiteboards that plan out everything, like um, work schedules and stuff. And I like to calculate a lot of our earnings so that way we can tell like, hey, this is what we're going to make today. And that's what we made yesterday. And it just helps me calculate stuff out. I have my like what to do for the day, my agenda, which is like counting money, editing videos, and then buying hair um, bleach because Katie and I are gonna be doing our hair soon. Um, then we have our cute little kitchen. This is one of the shelves that goes in the uh, fridge, but I've been cleaning out the fridge today and it has like stains in there from <sighs> syrups and stuff I bring from work. My wine glasses are so pretty and, and gothic. And then we have all this stuff. We have Elvis, the uh, swashy sponge. We have syrups from work, cause you know, why not? And then I have my own little baby espresso machine. And then we have all my crap, more stuff from work, of course, cause I get it for free. Um, that was from my past job. Wow, how garbage of them. It's like, we thought we were gonna need a lot of space for all of our stuff, but like, look how minimal we are. <laughs> That's it. We don't even take up a whole fucking like set of cabinets. We've got this crap, which is mostly Katie's because it's all like her little glasses and stuff. 
pen on her side and then on my Isaac's side, which is mostly my side because of my cups and stuff. Then we've got all of our other stuff. I got more beans from work and stuff. All of our little kitchen gadgets. Oh, and those are what I owe my um, family because they let me borrow food. Like, they give me food and they're like, just take it. But I'm going to return it. And then we have my little desk. Look at it. This is my office setup. It's tiny. Yeah, this is my laptop that my husband got for me on um, a great deal from freaking buy and sell. Then we've got my beautiful cup from work. Um, and then we've got my husband's setup, which is, of course, very nerdy and gamer style. Why not, right? Especially with these freaking products. Oh my god. Um, then we have cute little puppy over there. It's so cute. Um... Uh, Sorry if I'm dizzying you a lot with the zooming in, but I love doing the dramatic zoom in. Um, oh look, a poster that I made for one of my short films that I still haven't completed. There's a lot of glare on it. Um, this is for Katie to look at um, some interesting details. Um, then we have my balcony, which I think I've shown you before. Yeah, I think I showed you last vlog. It's just a short tour. And then, um, We've got our setup here with, of course, the longest Ethernet cable in the world to our freaking Xfinity. And then we've got Katie's setup. <laughs> uh, we were on a budget at the moment, so that's kind of just what happens. <laughs> uh, we have our cute little Rosemary who's growing freaking tall. That was not that tall before. What the frick? And then I don't remember who that is, so... <laughs> Unidentified herb? Who are you? Um... Je parle français aussi. And then, um, my gaming setup. This is where I play games. Game. I have my old boy there, and then I have new boy there. And then we have two TVs, just in case I'm playing video games or Katie's playing video games, and that's for TV. Um, she likes to crochet a lot, so she has a project ongoing right now where she's going to make all these little stuffy animals. And, um, they're just going to be all over the place. For a while. Oh look, how broke we are. <laughs> Not really. We had some help of food stamps for a while and then we got back on our feet and then, you know, still kind of eat like we're not on our feet anymore. <laughs> um, yeah, a lot of junk. I love this cute little closet that came with this apartment. Like it's a whole entire freaking and then with all of my products and Katie's products together, it's like a bath and body works in here. Like, we have all these cool products. Like, come on, dude. And we've been trying to get rid of them slowly, but, like, as you can tell, it takes forever to get rid of some of these things. Especially. Like, come on now. <laughs> so, we have a lot of stuff. That's for Isaac's blood pressure, because, I mean, he was born with that being a preemie. Um, and then we have all of our crap. <laughs> um... Katie's room, I'm just going to show you really quickly because it's really scary. Really scary. Okay, that's all you get. Hi, Beethoven. How are ya? And then here's my room. Nice and dark. I know, we don't have beds, okay? Don't judge me. <laughs> we just, uh, we got used to sleeping on the floor from my father-in-law's house, so we decided, you know what? It's good for our backs. Let's sleep kind of old-fashioned style. All of Isaac's crap, all of our posters from video games and 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 whatnot. Um, I mean, tell me, can you recognize some of these? <laughs> so nerdy. He actually painted me this and this one, and uh, my Back to the Future one, and then I have my closet, of course. And then we've got my little like school posters from theater. Um, tragedy kind of had a tragedy and uh, shattered. So we just have comedy. <laughs> um, I used to work for Instacart. I mean, I'm technically still signed up with them. I just don't do much because I don't really earn much. So in this city, it's not very profitable. Here's what I've painted before. Um, and then Isaac's American flag. And then I guess we have, uh, I don't remember. He's going to be like, you don't remember after I've told you a hundred times? Yeah, I don't remember. <laughs> Some of you guys are probably like, oh, it's this. Um, we have my other play posters and stuff. So it's personal. It's me and him. And then, look, everything that he's ever gotten for me, like a giant Easter duck. Chicky. Not a duck. Um, 
little chicky, big chicky actually, and then bears, and then he's got me all these pins that I put the, on the bears. I love hedgehogs to death, and also my newest obsession is my little sons. We have sons. They're a placeholder for now while I'm waiting to have children in the future. <laughs> but yeah, every single stuffed animal you can think of, he got me because he loves me that much. There goes another, some of the things that I've created in the past. I'm sure I've done vlogs on some of those. But yeah, that's all 1,000 square feet of my apartment. Not very big, but you know what? I'm not paying a one-to-one -one ratio on um, bills for it, which is what I consider is a dollar per square foot. Usually, I think of if you're paying less dollars than there are square feet, then fuck yes, that's a good ass deal. Swipe that place up. It may have problems with it, but you're getting a good deal for the amount of space that you need. <laughs> Cause honestly, if we didn't have this space and we still had the space that my father-in-law gave us, I'd be driven crazy still. Because that was insane. <laughs> I think we were in a 150 or 200 square foot room, bedroom, mind you, in the corner of a house, three people. Yeah, it was kind of like a college situation. <laughs> Except we didn't have bunk beds, we just had beds right next to each other. So that was insane. That is from a dickhead who had a dirty ass truck and had a rock flick at me. I'm done with another order. And where I had that last delivery was at this hotel that's far, far away. See it? I was on the fifth floor of that hotel that I live near. So that wasn't very, uh, difficult. That was an easy order. It was right there. Hi, how are ya? So I'm here just chilling in Cedar Rapids, in front of my apartment again. Man, I can't, I still have to get used to how to use this thing because I'm not used to it. Remember my little shitty Nikon cool picks? That's what I was used to using. That thing just focused by itself, but this thing is so like complex. Oh my God. Is that a focus? Hi. Oh my god, here's another advantage to working for Grubhub. Red Robin gives you free frickin' fries! Oh my god!